dive into the fascinating world of animals that rely on mud for survival. From playful piglets rolling in the muck to elephants cooling off in a muddy bath, The Mud Chronicles explores the hidden benefits of mud in the lives of farm and wild creatures. Discover how mud serves as a natural sunscreen, insect repellent, and even a camouflage tool for animals across different habitats. Through thrilling stories and surprising science, this journey into the wild will reveal how creatures big and small embrace the dirt to thrive. Get ready to uncover nature's messiest yet most brilliant survival secrets. Horses were domesticated over 5,000 years ago, originally in the steppes of Central Asia. They were used for transportation, farming, and as companions. Horses communicate through body language, facial expressions, vocalizations, neighs, whinnies, snorts, and ear positions. They can express emotions like happiness, fear, or curiosity using these signals. Rabbits belong to the order Lagomorpha, not rodents. They are in the family Leporidae, which includes hares, and are more closely related to pikas than to rodents. Rabbits have long ears that can grow up to 4 inches, 10 centimeters in length. Lions are known for their powerful roars, which can be heard up to 5 miles, 8 kilometers away. The roar is a form of communication that can mark territory or signal strength. Lions are the largest of the African big cats, with males weighing between 330 and 550 pounds, African buffalo can weigh between 1,100 to 2,000 pounds, 500 to 900 kilograms. Water buffalo can grow even larger, with some reaching over 2,600 pounds, 1,200 kilograms. They are known for their immense strength, capable of pulling heavy loads in agricultural work. African buffalo live in large herds, sometimes over 1,000 individuals, for protection against predators. Cheetahs are the fastest land animals, capable of reaching speeds of up to 60 to 70 miles per hour, 97 to 113 kilometers per hour. In short bursts, usually around 20 to 30 seconds. This incredible speed allows them to catch prey in open grasslands. Camels are famous for their ability to survive without water for long periods. They can go for several days without drinking by conserving moisture in their bodies. When they do drink, they can consume up to 40 gallons 150 liters, of water in one sitting, rehydrating rapidly. Camels are incredibly well adapted to hot, arid climates. Donkeys are smaller than horses, standing around 3 to 4 feet tall at the shoulder. They are compact and sturdy animals with strong legs and a thick coat that helps protect them in harsh conditions. The domestic donkey's scientific name is Equus asinus. Donkeys are smaller than horses, standing around 3 to 4 feet tall at the shoulder. Hyenas have one of the strongest bite forces relative to their size, enabling them to crush bones with ease. Spotted hyenas live in clans led by a dominant female, matriarch. Clans can consist of up to 80 individuals. 
Hyenas can digest nearly all parts of their prey, including bones. Koalas are marsupials native to Australia, primarily found in the coastal regions of Queensland, New South Wales, and parts of South Australia and Victoria. Koalas are herbivores, with their diet consisting almost exclusively of eucalyptus leaves. Hippopotamuses live in rivers, lakes, and swamps, where they spend most of their time submerged in water. This helps them stay cool under the hot African sun, as their bodies can overheat quickly in the heat. Hippopotamuses are herbivores, and they primarily graze on grasses. They feed at night, consuming up to 80 pounds, 35 kilograms of grass each night. Leopards are found in a variety of habitats, including rainforests, savannas, grasslands, deserts, and mountainous regions. They inhabit areas across Africa, the Middle East, and parts of Asia, including India, Sri Lanka, and China. Leopards are opportunistic feeders and have a diverse diet, including antelope, deer, monkeys, birds, and even fish. Pandas are primarily herbivores and feed almost exclusively on bamboo. However, they are technically omnivores and occasionally eat small animals or fish. Pandas are mostly solitary. Each adult has its own territory, though they may meet during mating season. Ring-tailed lemurs are found only on the island of Madagascar and some small surrounding islands. They eat fruits, leaves, flowers, bark, and even insects, making them opportunistic feeders. Unlike many lemurs, ring-tailed lemurs spend a lot of time on the ground, terrestrial, rather than in trees. Crocodiles have been around for over 200 million years, meaning they existed alongside dinosaurs. Their basic design has remained relatively unchanged over time. Crocodiles are cold-blooded reptiles, meaning they rely on external temperatures to regulate their body heat. Elephants have extraordinary memories, and their intelligence is among the highest in the animal kingdom. They can remember places, individuals, and experiences for many years. Their intelligence is demonstrated by their ability to use tools, solve problems, and communicate with each other. Elephants are highly social animals, living in tight-knit family groups. Wolves live in packs, which are usually family groups. A pack typically consists of a breeding pair, the alpha male and female, their offspring, and sometimes other unrelated wolves. Packs work together to hunt and raise young. Wolves communicate with each other through a combination of vocalizations, howling, barking, growling, body language, and scent marking. Tigers are the largest of the big cats. The tiger's scientific name is Panthera tigris. It belongs to the big cat family, Felidae, and is the largest species in this family. Adult male tigers can weigh between 400 to 675 pounds, 180 to 306 kilograms, 
and grow up to 10 feet, 3 meters long, including their tail. They are incredibly strong. Zebras are social animals that live in groups called harems or herds. A typical harem consists of one male and several females with their young. Herds can include up to 20 individuals, but larger groups may form for protection against predators. Zebras are herbivores and their diet consists mainly of grasses, leaves, and shrubs. Dogs were domesticated around 15,000 to 40,000 years ago. They are believed to have evolved from wolves, with early humans selectively breeding them for traits such as companionship, herding, and hunting. Dogs are highly attuned to human emotions. They can read facial expressions, body language, and tone of voice to gauge how their owners are feeling. Rhinos have thick, protective skin, but it's surprisingly sensitive to sunburn and insect bites. They love rolling in mud to cool off and protect their skin. A rhino's horn is made of keratin, the same material as human hair and nails. Unlike other horned animals, rhino horns are not attached to the skull and grow throughout their lifetime. Rhinos are herbivores, feeding on grasses, leaves, fruits, and twigs, depending on their species and habitat. Lionesses are fiercely protective mothers. After giving birth, they usually raise their cubs in a secluded area away from the rest of the pride. They nurse their cubs for about six to seven months, but will start introducing them to the rest of the pride earlier. Lionesses are the primary hunters in the pride. They often hunt in coordinated groups to take down large prey, such as zebras, antelopes, and buffalo. Cows are widely known for producing milk, which is a major source of dairy products like cheese, butter, and yogurt. A single dairy cow can produce between 6 to 7 gallons of milk per day, depending on the breed and care. Cows are herbivores and have a unique digestive system with four stomach chambers, the rumen, reticulum, omasum, and abomasum. This allows them to efficiently break down tough plant materials like grass, hay, and grains. Discover how mud serves as a natural sunscreen, insect repellent, and even a camouflage tool for animals across different habitats. Through thrilling stories and surprising science, this journey into the wild will reveal how creatures big and small embrace the dirt to thrive. Get ready to uncover nature's messiest yet most brilliant survival secrets.